it kind of opens up your mind to like a level of like enlightenment. When you're first learning how to code, writing out for loops and things like that takes like cognitive energy. It's not second nature, especially when you're learning a new language for the first time, there's friction in just like getting your thoughts into code. But when you get to the next level, like you can write out binary search or even a depth first search algorithm very, very quickly. That takes zero effort. And that's when you can kind of start focusing on the more complicated stuff. You can focus on how are you branching your recursion? What is the condition for shrinking the sliding window and increasing the sliding window? People skip a step. People don't get good at the basics. They just try to go to the harder stuff. Like why not just solve a really, really simple binary search or sliding window problem five times? Because it's not going to take you very long. If you solve it the first time in 15, 20 minutes, solve it again the next day. It'll probably take you 10 minutes. And you're probably thinking, well, I don't want to memorize the solution. There's an element of memorization in every type of learning.